Alright, welcome guys to a quick guide on how to get Brutal Doom to work. The latest Brutal Doom as of 2025 February with the latest remade music that was ported by Night Dive. To get these all working with the latest re release of Doom 1 and 2, as you can see. First of all, make sure you get this one. We need this one. From Steam or GOG. Not so sure about the Game Pass version. I will just ignore that just to be safe and just get either the Steam version or the GOG version. After you've bought it, go to zdoom.org to get the blue one. Choose your OS. I got Windows. I already downloaded these, so I won't be downloading them, but get the correct one for yourself always the latest version make sure it's the latest same with this brutal doom mod right here as you can see home page scroll down scroll down files get brutal doom version 22 beta test 4 september 14th press on it download it right here same with the music download it right here all right after you got them all first off what we need to do is extract gz doom so i already done that i got a file right here in my games folder gz doom that i will show you all right here you go open it up i use seven zip right here just extract these all into here make sure they're just all together then brutal here brutal test that's brutal doom don't forget you don't need to change rock take this one dump them in here as you can see all in the same folder however and this one is the music music mode as you can see what file we need what files by the way so what we got to do to make this one work is we need a folder called skins this one is what you need to make yourself it doesn't come with so just make a new folder called skins open it up and drop them in here after you've done that go to wherever you installed your uh, your steam folder and then open up your doom as you can see this is my backup if you got the correct correct version you will have this it says base dos box and re-release ignore these two you don't need those two we need base so after you've opened base as you can see doom what we need this one and in inside doom 2 another one we need both of them drag and drop them into your root of your gz doom as you can see doom doom 2 and brutal test right here so what we do is first of all what i always do is open gz doom go to options make sure it's Vulkan if you have of course a GPU that supports Vulkan always go open GL but you can all leave them on default you don't need to do these right, it's the game close this one what, what we now got to do is as you can see click on this one brutal test drag and drop them on to GZ Doom it will open it again choose Doom 1 or 2 after you've chosen your game player play game will load as you can see your intro changed I already got a save so I will go into my hey, Frosty. first of what you need to do what I always do is go to brutal options right here in my opinion just if your PC supports this of course if it's hardware is powerful enough choose enable all features otherwise default or whatever one of these four after you've done that go to options customize controls make sure you do these one to your buttons that you want after you've done that make sure that you do not use save current settings for some reason it goes back to default just press on escape again 
Here you go again. You guys think we're gonna make it out of this yeah. at all? As you can see, it works just fine. Alright guys, it's that, it's that simple. Hope you liked it, enjoyed it, subscribe and like. Peace.